hello welcome to my channel this is Nia Muda, and in this video I'm going to teach you how to do um, a simple quote template let's get to it let me quickly remove this now I want my background to be um, let's can I use white Oh God! So let's get the quote in pixel. I can just get the quote by clicking on the quote icon there, and you can see a lot of quotes. Okay, so I just want to use this for as an example of a quote. Okay, so let's say this is a quote we want to use. Okay, um, let me change the font. Let's use. Right, so I want to use this font, something like this. So let's get a shape. Let's get a shape that we're going to be using for the design. Okay, this is this is shape. Now use the radius, increase the radius, the percentage to have the curve, a bend curve in your design. So let me put a color so that you see what I'm doing. Okay, this is it. So I'm just using a red. All right. So let's bring the text forward. Bring the text forward. And of course, you know that black doesn't work on a red. So let's change the font color to white. Exactly. So this is it. Okay. So, but then, in most of these tem most temp uh, templates, they are pictures. So, I just want to add a picture. So, I want to use a circle to add a picture. So, I'm going to put it right here. Okay, I'm going to put it right here. Okay, and I'm going to add a red outline. Red outline. Okay, I've added a red light line. I'm gonna increase it. All right, so something like that. Then I am going to. I'm going to add here the name of um, the person that is taking this quote. So I'm just assuming it's not my quote, but I'm just assuming just to practice okay so the name of the person is going to be there okay oh sorry about that so now the person is going to be right there yeah something like that okay and the picture of course is going to be inside that um, circle so let's get a picture Oh my god, let's get a picture. Okay, I'm here with a picture that I want to use. So I selected it from my gallery. So this is it. So because it's a circle, I'm going to make I'm going to crop it with this circle here. Okay, circle. You can see it's circle. Crop it with the circle. And I'll make sure that it's the same circumference with the other circle. So like this like this like this all right so let's go and work on it all right so i you see that it's not sitting properly so the way to do it is um let's see the way to do is this let's reduce it a little first i want my head to cut out so i'm going to do like this almost there so take it a bit and then work on this side all right it has properly sit you can see it's sitting on it very well so that is that but the the, the color of my um the color of my suit the suit doesn't match with the red so i will just make it a black and white 
and then I'll increase the contrast yeah exactly so this is what I want to achieve okay so this is just a simple or a basic coat design you can use any color to form your background also you can use this you can use that and make sure you're using a color that goes with the red all right so you see this color don't match at all all these colors i'm using and that's why i'm using this particular um sorry this particular red, um, white color because it goes very well with the red so this is just a basic basic um quote design there are other ways to do it there are other ways you can use other templates you can decide to bring this image here at the bottom it doesn't matter you can decide to bring this name here and then so there's no particular okay you can decide to do it like this it's still the same thing and then you put your social media um, handles around um, the bottom there okay so this is just a basic quote design so let's let's see um let's see so this is just it so the first thing is you get your background you get your your background okay which is this particular one your shape and then make sure that you use this um, option this edit option radius make sure the radius is 8 or so and then after that you get your circle the shape that you want to use and then make sure that you place it in a strategic position it depends on where you want it to be so place it in a strategic position after that bring your image and crop your image with the circle option here and make sure that you put you place it in such a way that it sits our feet very well properly in your design and make sure you zoom it out so that you know exactly or you can see exactly what you are doing okay so that's that then also you will also get your text which you want to use and then after you centralize it very well you can add the name of the version that have the quotes in this case it's not my quote i just use it as an example all right i hope you are able to design yours thank you make sure you subscribe to my channel have a nice day